smooth, like a fine wine or a delicate scotch. <laughs> What's going on guys? This is Burrs. Today I got the 2016 uh, real men's Christmas slash holiday slash Black Friday slash whatever the hell you're calling it gift list. Now last year's list was a huge hit. Lots of people um, had sent their the gift list video I made to uh, friends, family, and all that. Uh, helped them get some stuff that they saw on the video that they liked. Hopefully this year is no different. So this year's list runs the gamut. It runs the table. It goes from electronics to outdoor, to tactical, to hunting, to even some cleansing stuff. So let's take it, let's get a blip. Let's get started. So one of the things I get asked a lot is about editing videos. Uh, what do I use? How do I edit? Uh, what software do I use? And uh, you know, th these headphones right here, which is what I'm gonna recommend, uh, are a pair of the headphones I've used for two years now. I really enjoy them. And they're not a lot of money. If you get over the ear headphones, people always look at Beats and uh, stuff like that that's super expensive. But this is a pair of Entune over the ear headphones from Monster and they're in the $50 range. Uh, depending on the color you get, it could be 45, it could be 65. Um, I went with the white, I forget, I think they were 60 bucks. But for 50 bucks, you're not gonna find a better set of over-the-ear ed uh, headphones. And the bass, the treble, um, the highs, the lows, um, it all comes through crystal, crystal clear. Um, super comfortable, and the cool thing is you can pretty much do whatever you want with these, and they're not going to break. I throw these in my bag, go about my business, throw them on the floor, um, throw them across the room. So if you're looking for a really good set of headphones, someone's wanted them. Uh, they got like zillions of colors. Entune headphones from Monster. Link below. So maybe you're buying a present for someone who travels a lot. They go on a lot of uh, trips, whether that be on the train, on an airplane, whatever. And they can't carry a gun, can't carry a knife uh, due to whatever circumstances. Another solution to that in self-defense is a pen. Uh, people call these tactical pens. Uh, this is a CRKT Williams pen. I've had it for about a year now. Uh, taken it on flights, uh, carried it on, never had a problem. It looks just like a pen, but it is geared towards on this side um, a little bit more of a defense mechanism. And on this side, you get a regular pen. It actually uses a Fisher Space Pen refill. Uh, you can write upside down and all that shit. And uh, it's a really good pen, nice and heavyweight. It's aluminum. It's not too heavy, it just has a little bit of weight to it. But it's shaped as well as though you can use it in different situations. You have to look those up yourself. Um, CRKT has videos on the inventor and what he says um, they can be used for. Obviously, if you know what they can be used for in different holds and stuff, then um, maybe you don't have to watch it. But anyway, if you're looking for something for someone who wants self-defense when they can't have it with a gun or a knife, the CRKT Williams Pen, 35 bucks, link below. Now, if the person that you are purchasing a holiday gift for is a hunter, what better way than to say I love you than a great sling? Now, I'm in the heirloom stuff, particularly when it comes to certain types of rifles. Um, this is a heirloom rifle with an heirloom scope, a scope mount, everything's pristine. It's gonna last years and years and years, decades and decades. Um, you wanna have a sling that goes with that. This is a great leather sling by Mission Mercantile. It's $90. Um, the stitching on it is amazing. You can see, so you get the whole thing in the picture here. Um, it's just made to last. It's made by a great company, made in the USA. Like I said, stitching is great. They use brass um, uh, hardware, so you're not gonna have any rusting or weather problems, and I wouldn't expect you would for that price. So if someone's been complaining about a sling, they wanna get a sling for a new rifle, old rifle, Mission Mercantile makes a great one, 90 bucks, link below. So let's say you wanna get someone a little bit more expensive gift. Maybe a backpack. Backpack's gonna last. This Tactical Tailor Urban Operator Backpack is the way to go. It's made in the USA. It's designed very well. It's made very well. The stitching on it is great. Um, 150 bucks. I don't think you can go wrong. I've reviewed this in the past. I'll put a link down below to that review so you can see the full thing if you're interested in it. But if you're looking for an everyday backpack that doesn't scream tactical and all that other bullshit, uh, the Urban Operator Pack from Tactical Tailor is definitely the way to go. I use this one every single day. It's low key, it just looks like a backpack. And um, made by a great company, made by Patriots for Patriots. So if they're looking for a backpack, 150 bucks, uh, gonna last forever, lifetime guarantee. Tactical Tailor Urban Operator Pack. Also, it has a bright orange inside, so if they get lost, maybe they uh, went to the mall, they're looking for their wife, they can't find them, you could just uh, flip this inside out hold it up, call your wife's name, she'll show up. So that's a good one. So we talked hunting stuff. Now let's talk a little bit of tactical stuff. We also talked self-defense, but let's talk tactical. Let's talk about 
a great price on a great item um, if you're building a rifle or upgrading yours. The BCM Gunfighter Grip. Uh, I forget which one this is. They make a few different sizes and shapes. Um, but I've been using this for uh, a few months now, maybe about a year at the most. And uh, I really like it. $17 is the price on it. Um, so it's not going to break the bank at all, but it is going to upgrade your rifle if you have a basic grip on it. Uh, like I said, made in the USA, you can't really go wrong. BCM Gunfighter Grip, link down below. Let's talk about outdoors. You know, one thing that a lot of people don't talk about is books. Um, I'm not going to get mine because it's packed away, but a, a great book you could purchase someone for the holidays, it's under $20, would be Bushcraft by Morris Kachansky. Kachansky. Uh, something. If you're into outdoors, bushcraft, all that stuff, you know, this guy is in the news. He's been in the news for decades. He's a uh, top of the line, knows a lot about bushcraft, outdoors, and survival. Um, the book itself, an amazing book, easy read, which is very important. So if someone in your family is looking to get into uh, bushcraft, survival, um, outdoors kind of backpacking stuff, um, or they are looking for something different, or maybe they just would enjoy, you know, opening up their minds and maybe reading about something else to put in their toolbox, their brain, uh, check out the Bushcraft book. Uh, I'll put a link down below to it. So we got two items left. One's gonna be electronic, one's gonna be tactical slash self-defense slash whatever the hell you wanna call it. So let's talk about the electronic. You know, I'm a runner, I do run from time to time. Um, I do try to get out and get some cardio, even though I do hate it. But uh, the one thing I found is when I'm running, I like to hear around me. I'm a responsible runner. And the one thing, the one pair of headphones I found that really help with that are these Bose Sound Sport headphones. These are in the ear, they're actually kind of in the ear canal. So they allow you to hear outside as well as the music. You're not gonna hear the music, you know, as a uh, noise canceling with these. Uh, excuse me, I had a burp. What you're gonna get with these is being able to hear all the noises around you so you can be a responsible runner. Um, a lot of people will throw on maybe some over the head, over the ear headphones when they're running. Um, you know, you just kind of put yourself at risk when you do that. So I found these to really be great. They're about 100 to 120 at the most, um, different colors and stuff like that. You guys know Bose makes really quality stuff. The, uh, the clarity of the music that I hear through this is really good. Um, and I just like to hear the ambient noises around me so that I know what's going on. Or if you're someone who really likes to pay attention around you, um, because you know, you're into self-defense and all that stuff. They're also great for that. So you can always pay attention to what's around you as well as hearing your music when you're going for a run. I use my hands a lot, as you can see. It's a uh, detriment to my brand, I think, possibly. So now let's talk about the last item before we get to some stocking stuffers. The last big item is gonna be the Benchmade Sock P Dagger. Make sure you don't just buy the dagger for someone if you buy it. Buy the kit that comes with the training knife with it. You don't want to pull this out and train with this knife. You want to train with this one. This one is not sharp. It's blunted or I would be dead right now. The Sock P Dagger is very versatile. It's probably one of the more versatile self-defense items on the market. You can use it kind of like you would with a Pendix draw. You can put it right here, put it over top. No one can see it. Uh, if you have to, you can draw it up. It's out of the way. You can also use this on a plate carrier. Um, so, uh, military personnel, police, you can use this on a plate carrier, put it down the PALS webbing because it fits between. Um, and then you have a nice last ditch um, item here with this dagger. It's going to run you about $100, $125 depending on which uh, website you're at. I'll put a link down below to Amazon which seems to have uh, more of a consistent price for these. But also, again, make sure you buy the kit so that they can train with the blunted one link down below. So now let's talk about some stocking stuffers. Some things you're gonna stock some stock some socks with. First off, more knife. This is the 546 version. They make a red handle and a blue handle. Under $12, this would be an excellent gift for someone who is getting in the bushcraft, getting into backpacking, um, getting into the outdoors, so to speak. Um, has a three and a half inch blade, uh, a great handle. It's just an all around great knife to uh, to get someone who's getting into you know outdoors kind of stuff, uh, a beginner. You can even use it if you're not a beginner. Uh, you can throw it in an emergency kit. This is a great knife and emergency kit. That's what this one's from. It's from my emergency kit. Um, you know, under 12 bucks, you really can't go wrong. I'll put a link down below to both. There's a red and a, and a blue handle, like I said. Blue handle is stainless steel. Red handle is carbon steel. The blue handle is stainless steel, which means it's not going to rust. Uh, it's going to be a little more difficult to sharpen. It's going to hold an edge longer. The red handle, which I don't have, you just pretend this is red. Uh, the red handle is carbon steel. It's going to sharpen easier. It's going to be sharper, 
um, but it will rust so you have, to have more maintenance with it. So depending on what they're into, um, if they're a beginner, I would get them the blue handle. If there's someone who specifically says they want the carbon steel version or a carbon steel knife, or you hear them talk about they love carbon steel, go ahead and get them the red one. The one thing I don't hear a ton of people talk about is medical stuff. And these SWAT T tourniquets are the way to go. They're a great stocking stuffer for under $12 each. I'll put a link down below. Um, but if someone's in the medical, if someone's into having a kit in their car, if someone, um, like I said, just talks about medical stuff, they're into tactical, they're into hunting, um, this SWAT T tourniquet is gonna be a great stocking stuffer for under $12. They have an orange one and they have a black one. And um, depending on what they want or what's available, that's what you're gonna get. But easy to use, super small, lightweight, you can't go wrong, under 12 bucks, great stocking stuffer. So to round out the stocking stuffers in the entire video is gonna be a soap. It's made by Duke Cannon, and part of their uh, proceeds go to support veterans. Kick ass, love it. These are called the big ass bricks of soap. They have all kinds of different flavors. This one smells like accomplishment. This one is scent eliminator hunting. They have uh, smells like Navy supremacy, supremacy. Uh, they have all kinds of different ones. I think they have three or four other ones than what these are. And they also sell something if you're into working out, you live in a hot climate like Arizona. They also have a cold shower cooling cubes. Um, you can use, these work really well um, over here on the East Coast when it comes out with the humidity and the heat of the summer. You go out for a run and like I do, you come back and you're just toasted because of the heat. You go ahead and take a shower with one of these. You feel way better, you're cooled off. It's just a great experience. These bars of soap are under $10, but they're big ass bars of soap. Like um, it says right here, big ass bar of soap. Lasts really long compared to just a regular little dove piece of soap. Uh, you're probably gonna get two to three times the amount of washes as you would with um, those little shitty dove and dial bar soaps. Um, it's also easier to hold because they're so large, um, unless you're used to holding large things, not sure. Uh, this is a great stocking stuffer, under 10 bucks uh, per bar of soap, gonna last forever, unique, and they support veterans. So hopefully this video was helpful in finding out some maybe some different things you could purchase the guys in your life, whether that's your boyfriend, your husband, uh, your brother, uh, your dad, etc. If you're a dude and you see this video and you wanna send this over to someone and be like, hey, you know, some of the stuff in there looks really good, go ahead and send this over to some of your family members, your friends, uh, whoever you guys are swapping gifts with this year. Go ahead and send this over to them so they can check it out and get some ideas. All the links are down below to where these items are. A lot of them are on Amazon. So if, you're, if you or other people use Amazon, it's really easy just to go down, find it, uh, add it to your cart and go. I like Amazon personally myself. It works well, free shipping, uh, great returns. Um, I do enjoy using Amazon myself. So links down below. Thanks for watching. Uh, have a great holiday, a great Christmas. And until next time, later. Amazingly well. Kind of like a well-oiled machine, a well-oiled gun. You just pull the trigger, you're gonna get what you want. That's stupid.